Один будет. Hi, hello, I'm Bon. Uh, at the back of me is a Daikin Super Inverter. The model is RZR125MBMZ. Okay, uh, the error code is L4. Okay, let's go. We take a look. What is the problem? Daikin Super Inverter R410. Okay. Okay. okay, power is off. This is the hissing, eh? inverter hissing. Inverter. Thermistor. This is an uh, inverter fin thermistor. Eh? Inverter fin thermistor. The reading is uh, 13.2 kilo ohm. Okay. This is the fin thermistor. Fin thermistor. The clip is uh, X111A. X111A eh? white color so far the fin temperature is 31 should be ok ok now we can use two of you can see the tongue ok this is this PCB replaced before eh? but the previous company the contactor never apply the screw 1 2 3 ok never tighten properly The PCB also may spoil. Uh, we also open uh, and take a look. Whether got put a ply compound. Okay, this is very important. Uh, this can cause the PCB faulty. Uh, see, never apply compound. The pipe is come up, never touch uh, the heating. Actually, it is a wrong way. Pull uh. this no screw. Uh. Never tighten properly. Two both the same model. Okay. And the good one got three screw tighten. Okay. For this one, uh, actually never apply the heating compound. I never tighten the three screw. Actually, the screw also missing. This cause, uh, this case cause the error code L4. Okay, if L4, I check this. Uh, this is very important. Uh, uh, okay, uh, we need to apply the hissing compound. Uh, this compound is for transfer the heat away from this component uh, from this heating okay this is inverter heating is done we need to fix okay we need to apply this okay hissing compound and three piece of the screw okay this is very important because these two
cause the error L4. Okay, after apply the hissing compound, we need to fix the this metal plate. Okay, to hold the copper pipe. Okay, after fix the aluminum plate, now we need to screw. Okay. To fix the panel, uh, now we need to tighten the screw. Total three screw. Uh. Okay, before the screw is missing, but this screw also important. Uh, must put back and tighten properly. After we do the checking, uh, we found uh, actually the inverter PCB, the inverter hissing, uh, inverter hissing, the screw missing and never apply the hissing compound. This PCB replaced before by others contactor. Okay, please remember the inverter PCB, the hissing must apply the hissing compound to transfer heat away okay from the component this is very important and the screw must be tightened okay let's go we go and test one okay the hissing compound is applied and the screw already tightened we need to on the power okay switch on the power supply okay we wait the complication after that we need to on the icon Okay, now the aircon is working. Okay. Okay, compressor is cut in now. Seven M. Please, I need your like and share and subscribe my YouTube channel. I will do more video to show you. Thanks. 13 M. Inverter frequency 61 Hz. Low pressure 132. High pressure 364. Suction temperature 6.3. Discharge temperature 68. The room is cooling. The inverter fin temperature 39. Okay, liquid temperature 8, gas temperature 8.5. Air temperature 17.7. Setting temperature is 17. Uh, the aircon is running good. Okay, the cooling is perfect. 